of going out for baseball, though. Yeah. Seems pretty nice for it right now. I mean, all throughout this yeah. week, we're seeing sunny conditions in the afternoon, especially just near that park. However, mm -hmm. in the early morning hours, it's we're soaked in. Cold with that and foggy. Fog. Exactly. Yeah. And it's going to last for a little bit longer mm -hmm. for us this morning in certain pockets. I'll show you that in just a second. But let's start off with a live look over in Walnut Creek this morning. This is beautiful. I mean, the sun's beginning to kind of head over us. To add to that, we're seeing clear conditions just in the city. And just past that, you see that marine layer kind of floating its way into the bay or into our inland areas of the bay but later into the afternoon it will pull right back out and we're going to be left with clear conditions across the whole inland areas now 56 right now in san jose for our friends just near oakland it's a little bit cooler 53 degrees right now heading into this afternoon we're going to warm up above average throughout our southern portion of the bay area actually even close to morgan hill 81 degrees there 75 in san jose that's pretty much right where we should be but where we warm up again is off in those east inland hills brentwood just the other day was sitting in the 90s today we're in the upper 80s, and that's such a major contrast compared to our friends along the coast who will need a jacket today before you head outside. This is your friendly reminder, 56, actually 59 today in Daly City, all the way up into San Rafael, we'll be sitting in the 70s. Now let's take a quick look at what we can expect with this marine layer. It's stubborn, and it is definitely a morning person if you ask me. Now, as we head into the next couple hours, this is all the way into the 12 o'clock hour, 1 o'clock hour. It starts clearing up just in Marin. However, it still stands strong along the peninsula. The less, they're the least amount we're going to see actually is closer to around 3 o'clock, and then it fills the bay in once again. Now, the winds are going to get gustier. Compared to yesterday, it's even stronger this afternoon, close to around 5 o'clock. 30 mile per hour winds sweeping in from the north, even gustier, closer to Bodega Bay. So keep that in mind, especially if you have allergies like me and you're sensitive. We're sitting in that medium to high category as we wrap up this week week and head into this weekend. And next weekend is Memorial Day weekend. So if you have outdoor plans, here's a look at a long range models right around average for us here in the Bay Area when it comes to our temperatures. So pretty much what you see right now is what you're going to get as we wrap up next week too. 80s in our inland areas, 60s just along the coast into San Francisco, Oakland, a very similar trend with some 70s popped in there too. And from the North Bay all the way down into San Jose, upper 70s and low 80s actually just to kick off this week and then it'll cool down into next week.